Good afternoon. Good evening, even, ladies and gentlemen, and everyone. Welcome to Crosswords and Chill at this rather later time of 6 pm. It's exactly the same stream, just a few hours later. My MSM Messenger is still returning zeros to some people. I don't know what the hell that's about. But we'll just roll with it. Uh, yes, I understand that uh, some people will be eating now. That's fine. Uh, take in what you can. Join in when you can. We'll be here when you are ready for it. How has taking your daughter for vaccinations? You know, it was it was a flashback to when I when I took her for her vaccinations when she was really small. It was like go to the doctor, hug her. They do an injection in one arm, they go and do an injection in the other arm. She cries a bit, she gets over it, we come home. The only difference this time is that she ate a chocolate egg as a treat for being good. Whereas when, you know, she was a lot smaller, she just you know, went to went for a nap or something. I don't I don't even remember. But yes, yeah, she was very brave. I'm very proud of her. And uh, it was a, a double vaccination, MMR part two, because they have it when they're a lot younger, and something else. There was a four in one, like polio, something else, I can't remember. I don't care what it is, as long as it's protecting my baby. Uh, shall we kick things off with a little bit of words on stream, just to warm our brains up? Which one do I want? I want that one. We'll warm our brains up see what we can do what we're not waiting for the host to start I press the button there we go got a new duvet today that's exciting duvets are great she'll probably pop in to say good night uh, before she heads up to bed a bit later yeah in about an hour she'll come in and say good night so you can you can see her then and see how brave she is mad Laz welcome First time here, I believe. Hope you enjoy. We're starting with some words on stream. We'll move to some crosswords a bit later. Do 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 do. Am I locked? Yes, I'm locked. Let's wait to not be locked. <laughs> Leet. Level one complete. Everything else is just gravy. See how many levels we can skip, whether we can get them all. My favorite kind of wrestler, a heel. Oh, I was looking at the chat and not the screen. I thought that was a rather rude opening from Mad Lass. <laughs> What's it, what was the word he put in? Helmet. He just came in like, you're a helmet. Mate. You're a helmet. Yeah, it wouldn't be very chill, would it? Uh, Lady is mean. Welcome. Just slightly too late for that first round, but don't worry. We've skipped three levels. We're kicking off level four now. Join on in. If you find the opportunity, do go down and slam that follow button. We do word games every Thursday. It's well worth following so you know when we are live. Condor. I like the condor. I do like a condor. Not typing in the chat, that doesn't help. That was that level smashed. That didn't take very long at all. That would... Wait for me to unlock and try it. No, nope, it is not. in there. Co 
Hodon. Don't know what that means. Alphabetically after Oda. Four letters. Yo, yo, Duff, welcome. How's it going? How's it going, everyone, for that matter? What's your day like? We're a little bit later in the day than we usually are for this, so maybe more's happened to you. Maybe more interesting things have happened. Little cute girl, you're back. Did, did you ever leave? Or have you just been sat here? Been sat here since three, typing in the chat. Where is this guy? He's supposed to be live doing words and stuff. I'll leave it and come back later. And now you're back. Maybe that's what we've got going on here. Smash that one. Skipping three levels once again. Level seven is next. Uh, our newcomer, Mad Laz, is in second place with 45. The stalwart MJ Harmstone. Mike is in first with 60. Was hoovering? Probably couldn't hear a word I was saying then. Some people like it that way. Lurk, lurk, just picking up food. Okie dokie. Don't know what I'm having for dinner. Nor me, actually. Obviously, this would normally be the dinner time. But uh, I'm foregoing dinner to have word games with you lot. So we'll see what I have later instead. Oh, I've already got that one in there. Doom, 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 ba doom, ba doom. There we go. That was easy. Good job, team. Very impressed with that one. I smashed it. The wife's come and taken my place in third place. Point ahead of me now. Stop being negative, Diego. Arcade Glasgow, welcome for the follow. How's it going? Lots of arcade crew. Popping on you every now and again. You're very welcome. Just getting started with some words on stream before we crack into crosswords. Feel free to join in. Oh, stole my flan. <laughs> Nobody should steal a man's flan. Not right. Andy Lippy, welcome. How are you doing? How's life? I think the R might be fake. A few people have tried R words, including me, and they're not coming up. So perhaps you're right, the R is fake. I'm doing good. Uh, this is a different time streaming for me. It's either earlier than this or later than this. So it's quite interesting to be here at six. I haven't seen you in a, a couple of days. I can't think the last time you were streaming. Was it Tuesday? Monday? We're not doing terribly this time. <laughs> Arav. It is, it is not a Welsh game. You cannot put Arav in there. Ordered a polystyrene head, which, without context, sounds super creepy, Jaeger. You might want to provide the context there. Just bought a polystyrene head. Just going to creep people out with it. Just poke it out the window and be a creepy ass. Uh, it's been the missus' birthday. I've been a little busy trying to get a submission for the hackathon thing. Hackathon? I'm not familiar with hackathon. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Arcade Glasgow dropping in the follow to make sure 
But I wasn't going anywhere, I assume. Because they are bringing the raid and unleashing the squirrels. Thank you for the follow, Catherine Banner. It's a good job we're in between games now and that we'd already smashed that one. Because you can't really see anything with dancing squirrels. Invading. Welcome, welcome, Arcade Glasgow. What were you doing this this afternoon? And what have you been streaming? Very much appreciate the raid. More word puzzles. You were doing words on stream. There we go, then. There we go. Yeah, we were doing... We're doing some words on stream to start, and then we're going to crack into some crosswords when we fail miserably, uh, probably at around level 17 to 20. Yeah, Andy, tell me about this uh, hackathon. I'm not familiar with that, but it sounds interesting. Why is this returning zeros? It's pissing me off now. I don't understand why it's returning zeros. It works sometimes, and then it just doesn't others does my head in. But this is not crosswords and rage, this is crosswords and chill, so I'll get over it. Here we go, there's a fake letter once again. It's a Twitch competition making something unique with channel points. Mm, yeah, it worked that time. It worked that time. <laughs> Sent an explanation. <laughs> I'm not a creepy weirdo buying heads. It's for my Hydra helmet. Because of the material it's made from, there's a chance the edges will curl up and ruin it unless I get a mannequin head and pad it with duct tape to keep the shape. Makes sense. And there's a zero again. I don't understand why it works sometimes and not other times. It should be exactly the same. The eye is fake. Yes, indeed, Karis. The eye is fake. Not that it matters. You did not need it. I didn't even need to participate this time. Three words left. We've got one alphabetically between fled and fold. Flow. Perfect. And another alphabetically between redo and roll. So it begins with R. And it's road. Are you going to do ASMR streams now? I don't think anybody really wants to hear me whispering. Whisper. Okay, let's catch up on some follows. Uh, Catherine Banner already thanked. Sheepy sheep, or sleepy sheep even. Thank you. Feral magical girl. Thank you for bringing your feralness to the stream and following. And Rykon the Destroyer. You are all very welcome. Uh, before we continue, let me just jump into a bigger screen for a second and do a shout out for Arcade Glasgow. Thank you very much for the raid. My notifications have died. Not sure why. Love and look at your stream. Thank you, man. It is uh, through you that I'm able to improve. You're pulling us through anuses. I'm so happy. <laughs> I've never been so happy to see the word anuses before in my life. Thank you, Laura. <laughs> That was impressive. <laughs> the perfect clip, indeed. Uh, and while I'm here doing shout outs, uh, I'd like to give Andy Lippy a shout out. Uh, the stuff that you see working on this stream mostly comes from Andy Lippy, or at least the know how comes from Andy Lippy, if not the actual thing. Very, very helpful, genuine, brilliant guy who I spend too much time in his stream trying to learn stuff. Oh, but before we do that, we're having a, a stick party, apparently. 
all happening tonight. Stick party for Brave Hannah. Ah, yeah, I suppose my my daughter doesn't normally get to watch these streams, but because we're out of time, she's probably sat in the other room watching me. But she's very brave after having her double vaccination today. So, yeah, she deserves it. Right, back to where I was, uh, praising and shouting out Andy Lippy. If you ever want to do anything on your stream, this is the guy to go and see. And he's like... Oh, I've actually met my nipples. <laughs> and that's about the experience you get. Yeah. Yeah, that about sums it up. <laughs> Let's jump back into a window and head into level 14. <laughs> I don't know how it does it. It just selects a clip at random and uh, yeah, it shows up some people. Okay, so we've got a fake letter and a hidden letter this time. Uh, Nanake has tried zones, and that has not been accepted. So, either the Z or the S is fake. The S has been being used, so I'm going to say the Z is fake. I think the Z is fake. I'm not sure what the hidden letter might be. Uh, an I? Looks like it's an I. People are using I. So, I is, I is hidden. Z is fake. Crack on. Knobs is a word. That is not very chill. Hmm. Yep, that's me done. Any words I had any hope of getting, you've already cleared, so I'll just sit here and not look pretty. Wait. Let's see if I can work out what's going on with some of this stuff. Do do do. Let's reset it. Find the right board number. Always fun. Smash this level again, folks. Good job. No, not six. Let's try five. Do, 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 do. Got some laundry done. You're just all about productivity, Jaeger. All productivity, all the time. There it is. See if it works now. Sorry you're late. No worries. No worries. Come on in. We're just finishing off. Well, hopefully not finishing off. Hopefully continue, continuing for a long time. Our opening words on stream. But this is normally where the wheels come off. Your help will be appreciated. Fake letter. Hidden letter. Baseball, Bosch, straight in there. Why didn't he give me that? Literally all the letters have been used. Why are you not giving me the... Oh, it's five letter minimum. That's why. That is why. Okay. Uh, Hannah Bortz, welcome. Fable, you tried and it didn't let you. So I'm going to say that F is the fake letter. Because all the other letters have been used in other words. F is fake. F is fake. Any idea what the hidden might be? We used anything new? 
<laughs> F is for food. Which I'm not eating right now. Many other people are. <laughs> was that you saying you're leaving for food? Uh, which I'm now going to get. Be right back. I knew there was a segue coming there. <laughs> Balls. <laughs> L is hidden. Ah, it gives us a double L. Yes, good point. Good point. <laughs> That's level complete. Is there a D there? No, there's no D. Yeah, Anagram's not my strong suit, so I'm glad you guys can rock this. I don't think I'd get out of the opening stages on my own. Uh, Lamia Umbra, welcome. Lots of new names popping up. If you are new here, introduce yourself. Tell me where you've come from. There's a big... Can anyone play? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely anyone can play. Uh, we had a big raid from Arcade Glasgow. If you came with them, let us know. If you've found us independently, let us know how you found us. It's always good to know where things come from. Uh, I've come to chill during lunch. Yes. Maybe there is a benefit to streaming at this time. I found you through the suggestions. Interesting. I like hearing that I'm in suggestions now. <laughs> hey Hannah, your name sounds like mine. <laughs> okay, the answers are now hidden. And we've got a hidden letter and probably a fake letter too. But you can look at the chat. <laughs> I found you through Nova. Uh, thanks, little cute girl. I didn't quite realise that. And Nova found me through Eric, whom I found through his podcast. I don't know how I got here, yeah. Well, yours is an even more complicated story. Okay, so the top word was squadron. So the Q and the U are fine. So is the S? I'm assuming D is hidden. R-O-N, yeah. Mr. Sportsball getting suggested now. Nice. Yes, indeed. I don't know if that's got something to do with it. Uh, J is fake. Sounds good. Gives us a little bit of time with the letters. Yeah, I don't know if I'm my... Like, what's the word I'm looking for? Visibility is better now that I'm part of this Twitch sports program. But I'll take it. I will absolutely take it. Perhaps a couple of A words left, at least between A and Q, which is quite a range. I tried nudes, didn't work. There we go! Bosh! Bosh. I think this might be the highest that we've got, crew. Might be the highest we've got. Level 22 coming up. Don't know why I'm sweating. I'm merely a passenger. This is all on you. Are we ready? Level 22. Let's smash it. Probably going to be hidden words again. I am thinking of ordering food. I'm always sweating. Very different. Rykon, I think you are some kind of words on stream ninja because you've just come in and smashed the top word two games in a row now. Five letter minimum. Chris and Val. So while toil and coil are fantastic words, the 
five letter minimum is now in effect. Okay, I'm going to try and pronounce this. Kinks Oceanid? Welcome. Not sure if I'm saying that right. Feel free to try and phonetically spell it. Twelve points to go to advance to another level. Do we have any idea what the fake might be or the hidden? Okay. We're through. We're through. The last word is alphabetically before clack. So it might be another CL. Cacti. Beautiful. The V is fake. Yes, thank you. And now we're moving to level 25. I can say without a shadow of a doubt that that is the highest level we've got to. Wow. I don't think I've seen that high up, actually, on anybody's stream. What's the highest anybody has been involved in and seen? What's the highest level? How high does it go? These are all questions. Level 25. Let's go. Charlie Pika, 30 for me is the highest. Let's try and get that going then. Thank you for the follow, Charlie. I'm not sure why my notifications aren't working. I can't explain it. I'll just make some noise instead. Booty, 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 boo. I feel like with the game and the music that I'm at Olive Garden. Olive Garden. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have no breadsticks. <laughs> this is not chill. That's loud. <laughs> Great. I don't know if you were trying a word then, Karis, or commenting on the stuff in the way. <laughs> yeah, he's just in here to be disruptive. So, eh, let's, let's throw a rider time in. The G is fake, okay. These words are moving stupidly fast. I'll just turn up with my European spelling. No, we're hearing A is fake. Ooh. We've got G is... Oh, there are two fake letters. Okay, okay, I missed that. So G and A are fake. Time's ticking away. We're not quite there yet. Mm. Not quite, unfortunately, team. It was a good, good effort. I agree. Yeah. When the letters start to move as quickly as they do at that level, I have got no hope. So I'm supremely impressed with any of you that are able to pull that off. That was super difficult. Let's just jump back into a full screen chat for a second while I prepare us for our first crossword of the day. Uh, for those that are new here, this is Crosswords and Chill. We uh, start things off with words on stream to get our brains warmed up, and then we do a couple of crosswords uh, from the Guardian quick crossword section. Um, there are no real rules. Everybody's welcome to participate, um, but it is a team group effort, so uh, don't rock up with 60 answers straight away. Let other people have a chance. Uh, I'll go full screen with it in a moment, 
I will read the clues. You're free to put in answers there and then uh, into the chat. Let me know what number and whether it's a cross or down. So for example, 1A answer, so it's easy to follow. And then uh, I'll scroll back up the chat and fill it in. So before I do that, I'm just gonna make my chat a little bigger to help myself out here. <laughs> don't forget to unzoom. I don't need to unzoom anymore. I've reconfigured things. Here we are with our first crossword. And I will read the clues out for you while you get started. The acrosses, first of all. Teases, informal, four letters. Give thought to, eight. Put forward, seven. Readily available, two, three. One eating out, five. Magnitude, scope, six. Where there's a long hyphen in the middle, it generally means that there it's two words with the same meaning. So it, it relates to magnitude and scope. Not before a stated time, two, three, eight. Grass cutting implement, six. Exclude, bread, it's an anagram of bread, five letters. Left hungry, five. Subtly in, uh, uh, subtlety in handling difficult situations, seven. Put up with, eight. Greenish blue colour, four. And the downs. Left over, eight. Started, five. Seemingly, two, three, four, two, two. Member of the weasel family, five. Easing of hostility between nations, seven. Tears, four. Legally binding decision, Six. Fish providing isinglass. Isinglass. Not sure what that word is. That's eight letters. Diplomatic. Seven. Cargo. Six. English royal house. Five. Disagree. Disagreeably domineering. Five. And finally, only fair. Four. Righto. Let's scroll on up. Kicking us off, Chris and Val with three across. Consider. And again, as we introduced last week, we're not going to check the answers until the end. I'm going to try and fill it out as we go and adjust if we need to. Next, uh, Mike, 25 across, Aqua. Could be Aqua, could be Teal. We'll bear that in mind as we move forward. Five down, stoat or otter? I went with stoat and it starts with S, given our other answer. So let's go with stoat. Uh, nine across, propose. Seems reasonable. Ten across, on tap. Lovely. And that fits with our other answer. Gives us a bit more confidence if... Our answers match up. Seven down, rips. It fits, it fits, it fits. I like this tune, the whistly one. It's a bit clangery. Uh, we're bearing in mind 25 across teal, little cute girl, but... Uh, it could be aqua. It probably is teal. I don't think there are gonna, is going to be a word ending in Q now that I think of it. So I'm going to change that to teal. It's more likely to end in E than it is to end in Q. Uh, eight down from Keris. Ruling. Doesn't fit with propose. So we'll bear that in mind for later. Keep that in your mind. Uh... And then Mike says 25 across is probably teal because it won't end in Q. I agree. 11 across, diner. And Tamsinaki. Let's try that. Lovely. Uh, and Chris and Val come in with the same. 11 across, diner. Okay. 
There were a few that I picked up as I went. Um, stream has frozen. The stream frozen for everyone, or is it just? No, I think it's just you, Jaeger. Have a, have a refresh. Refresh yourself. <laughs> Refreshed, dumb Twitch. I thought you were going anyway. That was the one. A grass coupling in cutting implement. Thank you, Tams, in a scythe. Gives us a T at the beginning of English Royal House, which I would suggest is Tudor. As I said, I am going. You lot and your fancy words hurt my head. I mean, they're not that fancy, but... Whatever. Yeah, Strimmer didn't fit. No. It's Arnold, 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 sausages? More reliable than a garden Strimmer. 22 across. Left hungry, ending in D. Five letters. Not sure about that one. 15 down. Diplomatic tactful. Yes. Fits nicely. And 24 across. Tolerate. Which also fits with what we have. This one's going to be a, a tough one, I think. A five letter answer. I'm going to say that's on. On something. I'm not, not too sure. 22 unfed. It could be unfed. Put it in for now. We can always change it. What's 21 down? Only fair. It's a hard one. It's 13 down sturgeon. It ends in L, if our teal is correct. I'm not sure. What is is in glass? I assume it's a, a byproduct of this fish, but... But I don't know. I don't know. Ribs for 1A Nana K? I think it could... It'll fit, at least. Um, started, I might have said began with that in mind. Which would make propose wrong. But I think that's the only thing that really fits. So I might change propose. Might change propose. 13 down mackerel, that could fit. Mackerel. That fits with teal. But let's leave that there for now. Let's clear that one. What was nine across? Nine across was put forward. Suggest. It's not typing. Why are you not typing? Why are you typing the wrong way? I'm going to say that's suggest. Let's clear that one. Mackerel can't be right because K isn't in on the anagram on 19. Good point. Good point. Let's clear that. Yeah. Okay. Well spotted. Let's see if we can get the anagram and it'll help us out. If if it fits with sturgeon, then uh, you missed my 21 down just. My apologies. That fits. Oh, I almost checked then. 25 across uh, cyan rather than teal, then sturgeon works. Okay. S oops, strugeon. Okay. Clippity cloppity click together. Beautiful. 
19 is D bar. If you say so. Four D is going to be on the expect you're right, which gives us a an E at the beginning of magnitude or scope on the face of it. Let's put it in for now. Yeah, that fits. That fits indeed. Good work, wife. Twenty down, bossy. Yep, that fits. Thank you, terms in. Subtlety in handling diff difficult situations is finesse, given what's there. Not before a stated time. In the moment? No. At. On the, yeah, it's either on the or at the. We'll leave that for the moment. Might get more from six down. Easing of hostility between nations, seven letters. D something T. Four other letters. It's probably going to be a word I've heard a bunch in my watch of the West Wing. I'm going to kick myself when I don't get it. It's not coming, though. One down. Left, o left over. I don't know why I pronounced that so much. Left over, left over, left over. Residue? Thanks, science. Oh. Oh, yeah, why is there a G there? Resid. Yeah. Residual? So I'm going to say that's at the. Rather than on the. Still fits then. 12 across extent? Yes. Thank you. Pam Bianca. Eight down are legally binding decision. Again, this is going to be a word I've heard a lot and is not coming to me. It's six letters. Something E, something R, something E. coming. Cargo, six letters. Something you carry, something that you deliver. Seems like Lamio Umbra got it before I did. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Two up above it. I apologise. I was getting carried away with the, the G's and the D's. Lamia, I'm sorry. Not Not so great with the reading sometimes. We've got a few now that's just going to take us home. Let's focus on this one for a little bit. Not before the stated time. So it's like at the start, at the, at the moment. It's an eight letter word, something A and nothing until the last letter of T. is harder without checking. Might check this one just to make sure the 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 is correct. I'm going to check it. 
It is. So at there is correct. Uh, eight down, decree. Yes. Beautiful. Thank you, Pam. At the earliest. Boom! Arcade Glasgow is back from food. Lovely. Which gives us an L at the start of 16 down. Which is cargo. L something D something N something. <laughs> Ing could be Ing. I'm willing to check it. It is Ing, so this is just gonna be a vowel. Lading? Is that a word? Yes, it is. Thanks, little cute girl. Never heard that word before. I guess it's this, similar to being laden, to be heavily laden. Laden in cargo. Your lading is too heavy, I don't know. But that's the thing. We've got one left. The easing of hostility between nations. It's seven letters. D, something T, something N, something E. So not quite a ceasefire, that's a cease of hostility, but the easing of it when things start to get better. It's probably a Frenchy sounding word. Don't know why I think that, but just given the letters that we've got. Detente? Oh my god, where did that come from? What part of my brain did that come from? <laughs> How did I do that? I went from... F that seems like a bit of a Frenchy word to... The word. I'm going to... Uh... <laughs> you know I completely guessed on that word, right? I, I didn't, but you should keep quiet and then we'd never know. We're like, wow, that little cute girl, she knows words. Man. I'm going to uh, thank Duncan the Singer for his French learning streams for that. And just bombarding me with French words. That one obviously stuck. Check, check all. Yes, here we go. It didn't get rid of it, so uh, I'm going to say that that is a correct crossword. Nice work, team. Nice work. We'll get into another crossword momentarily but before we do yeah ggs indeed I need to get get some ggs if anybody's got any gg emotes throw them up flood the screen with ggs what have we got in, in my selection any ggs about there's the arcade glasgow nice we'll have a bit of that there's a gg from my friend paris do this for the moment. Now then, before we crack into the next crossword. Okay, so I've been watching Understanding How Crosswords Work. That's fine. Hopefully you can join in on the next one. It's basically a clue, a number of letters. We put it in. Some of the words mesh together based on common letters. We complete it. Job done. It's your first time to try it too? Oh well, I'm I'm glad to pop your crossword cherry. It is, it's nice and chill. It gets us through a Thursday afternoon. I normally do this at three o'clock uh, on a Thursday afternoon, but uh, took my daughter for jabs today, so couldn't do it at the scheduled time, and we're here a bit later. We'll probably go for about two hours total, so hour and 10 minutes or so left. Uh, but before we crack into the next crossword, uh, I'm part of a team, the Primetime Streamer Network. That's a group of uh, 11 
wonderful streamers now. And here is what, uh, once I correct it, because I'm an idiot, put the wrong one in. There we go. And here is what is coming up uh, over the weekend from all of us on the Primetime Streamer Network. Uh, tomorrow, from 3 p.m., uh, an unscheduled, previously, surprise stream from uh, from Reese. It's 3 a.m. I better go to bed. Fair enough. Thanks for the follow. Uh, perhaps next week uh, we'll catch you slightly earlier. It'll be midnight rather than 3 a.m. But uh, thank you for the follow. I hope you can catch us again soon. <laughs> As I was saying, Reese is learning to play Rocket League at 3 p.m. tomorrow. He's finishing work early, so uh, he's inspired um, by Paris ENT. He's going to play a bit of that. Uh, at 8 p.m. tomorrow, it's the special mashup between Don't Get Me Started and Cocktails and BS that we call Don't Get Me Cocktailed in celebration of our 40th episode. It's basically me and always be chatting, sitting on the sofa, drinking cocktails, uh, making funny, um, mocking things, mostly each other, uh, and getting roasted by the chat and things like that. It's a, it's a lot of fun. Uh, if you only catch one of my streams every week, I suggest it's Don't Get Me Started because it's a lot of fun. Uh, I'm very proud of the way it's going. That's 8 p.m. GMT tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern. Uh, closing out the night tomorrow at 1 a.m. GMT, 8 p.m. Eastern in the States. It's a SNES grab bag from Brewster Beast, which basically means he uh, plays a bunch of SNES games. Neat. Who wouldn't like that? Uh, on Saturday uh, at 6.30 p.m., uh, Mama S is going to be playing uh, something. She hasn't announced it yet, but uh, she plays a few different games. Could be Mass Effect Andromeda that she's been playing a lot. Could be a uh, first-person shooter. We'll have to wait and see. If you are not in our Discord, jump in there for all the updates. At 7.30pm, it's the World Cup of Superheroes from Always Be Chatting. Uh, in said Discord, we have nominated a bunch of superheroes that we think are going to be the supreme superhero. We get together, we vote for them, and in the end, Mr. Tickle will stand victorious, and Jaegerax will be annoyed. It's going to be fantastic. At 9pm, it's the Mega mu mega Massive Music Stream, playing Drums and Rocksmith from Rooster Beast. The clue's in the name. I don't need to say very much more. Uh, Sunday is uh, a nice, chill, podcasty kind of day. Uh, I'm back on Twitch Sports with Research One and Duff Valley for the Effing Racing Show. Doing a 2021 season preview at 12 midday, 7 a.m. Eastern. Bit early for the Americans, but uh, okay. come on in anyway. Just have us on in the background as you snooze. 6.30 p.m. is Rocksmith from Duff Valley. We've got Double Duff with me at 12 and then at 6.30 playing some guitar. And then at 8 p.m. GMT, it's Two Minute Warning, the American football podcast where we discuss all the latest news two minutes at a time me and 2MW Matt 8pm GMT 3pm Eastern and that is that uh, are you going to give Alex the Mr Tickle book for Saturday? That's a good idea I think I will I have to leave, I will say bye for now and see you next week thank you for coming uh, Chris and or Val see you next week sorry for the late start <laughs> we're going to crack into our next crossword let me just put that in a... Where's my mouse gone? I'm going to put that... It's just Val this week. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, I'm just going to put this in a full screen. And off we go. Again, feel free to put your answers straight in the chat. I will scroll up once I finish reading you the clues. First of all, despicable, six letters. Dissertation, six letters. The Japanese Code of Chivalry, seven letters. Angry Frown, five. Air-filled cavity in one's head, five. Pine leaves, seven. Deposit, four, seven. E.g. Charles Pudemont, seven. Japanese cold rice dish, 
five. Contagious viral disease, five. I will say this crossword's from 2018. It isn't COVID. Just going to throw that out there. Unnatural sounding and over formal, seven. Dead, two, four. Cheap and nasty, six. And the downs, waylay, six. Leader of the Argonauts, five. Deep red, seven. Rushing, but with less speed, five. Distended, seven. Big media display, belly flop effect, six. Rowan, eight, three. Very best, seven. Redeemer, seven. Shrewdness, six. Noon, six. Light amplification by simulated emission of radiation, five. That's a science one for you, Karis. And finally, located, five. Let's see what we have. Me and Hannah are going for Danger Mouse. Yeah, Danger Mouse is a solid choice, to be fair. Uh, Carrie's kicking us off. Four across thesis. I think that might be correct. Yeah, we call it a dissertation. The Americans call it a thesis. Uh, oof, I am stuffed. Well, uh, no room for some Japanese cold rice dish. Five there, Tamsin. No. Uh, 22 across SARS. Uh, no, that's four letters. Yeah, it's five letters. Good idea, though. Uh, one across from Charlie. Rotten. We'll put it in there, see if it works as we fill more. 21 down. 21 down, sorry. Located, found. Yeah, that seems to make sense. Nope, not even a wafer thin mint. Well, there you go then. Ebola. Ebola. Yes, that's what was prominent in 2018. Let's put that in there and see if it fits. Uh, five down, haste. Uh, thanks for that, by the way. Not okay. Good answer. Five down, haste from Tamsin. <laughs> Brushing, but with less speed. Uh, 20 across sushi. Not with uh, an F in the middle, I'm afraid. Uh, and that's a fish dish, isn't it? The balls. What are the balls called? Rice balls wrapped in the um, the cabbage or the sea... Not seaweed. The leaf of some kind. I still like my Ebola cuddly toy, says Karis. Mm, that's because you're weird. That's because you're weird. Or it could be odious. Yeah, well, bear that in mind. Thanks, Charlie. Yeah. Located could be sought. Uh, we've got found in there at the moment. And sort is six letters. This is a five letter. It's quite hard to see on the stream, I know, but it's a it's a, uh, a six letter. Okay. I know this, but it's not coming to me. Japanese code of chivalry of chivalry. It's Bushido. There you go. Bash. That fits for now, at least. Uh, ten across scowl. That seems to fit. Thank you, Tamsin. And following up with a fifteen down saviour. Fit for now. It'll certainly fit for now. Leader of the Argonauts. I thought it was Jason. Is Jason not the leader of the Argonauts? He might be, which would change. Rotten. What was the other option that you gave? Odious. That doesn't fit either. But Jason is definitely the, the leader of the Argonauts. And it fits with Bushido. So. so get thinking about this one again. Despicable. It's got a J in the middle. Which sounds weird. Um, 25 across Cruddy. Seems to fit. Thank you, Tamsin. Uh, 
Okay, so if that starts with a V, which is unlikely for a Japanese word. Tells me that Saviour might not be right. We might have just happened upon the R here in Cruddy. We'll come back to it once we fill a bit more in. Uh, three down, Crimson. That fits. That fits indeed. Uh, 21 down, uh, Stood. We've got Found for 21 down, uh, Lamia. Uh, sushi's the only one you can think of. Yeah, sushi's a fish dish. We're looking for a rice dish. A Japanese rice dish. Sushi definitely is Japanese, but it is not a rice dish. <laughs> 14 down. Very best. Bestest? <laughs> no. 12 across. Pine leaves. Needles. Yes, they are needles. Thank you, Charlie. Gives us some letters over here for these downs. Six down, distended, so it means to stick out. <laughs> Bestera. What are you doing to me? So it's, something's distended, it's prodding out, it's sticking out. It's not coming. Seven down. Sushi's rice too, is it? And maybe, maybe both of these are wrong. Maybe both of these are wrong. If sushi fits... we try it? Swollen for six down. Thank you, Arcade. That definitely works. Sushi often has rice in it. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. I did not know that. If the sush fits, welcome always be chatting. Uh, sushi in there then. So it's clear saviour, because that doesn't fit anymore. And located. Um, Lamy, you had one for that instead. Stood? Could be stood. Let's put that in for now. That fits. So while I was there saying, no, it's not that, it's not that, it's not that, and I'm like, yeah, it's... might be right. <laughs> just tell me to shut up. And just shut up and put my words in. Stop with this thinking that you're doing, it's not working. Just put in the words that we say. We're just talking about you always be chatting in the uh, World Cup of Superheroes coming up on the weekend. I'm going to lend you Mr. Tickle. I think it's necessary. I, w I would like a live reading of Mr. Tickle just before the vote so that people know what they're voting for. Seven down. Splash. Yes, it is. Now the clue makes sense. Thank you, Karis. I use that word all the time in the big media display context. Uh, 15 down. Cashier. Yeah. Different type of redeemer. There we go. It all seems to be, uh, to be coming on a different kind of redeemer than the one you were thinking of. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, 17 down. Midday. Yes. Thank you, Lamia. Midday. Midday. Gives us a few letters for this. Unnatural sounding and over formal. What do we think about 15 down as Messiah, like Lamia suggested? Have I missed another one from Lamia? I suck at that. 15 down, 15. Oh, Messiah could work. Should we go back to chatting? No, we should not. Messiah could work better, actually. Both fit in different contexts. Well, keep that in mind. This is going to be the clue that, that decides it. Yeah. Both work. The different meanings of Redeemer. We'll leave it for now. This is going to be the make or break. And let's deposit 4-7. 
It's a down payment. It's a down payment. Which puts an M here, which does make it... Oh, the other way, please. Messiah. Which changes cruddy. So let's clear that. That's going to be shoddy. There we go. We fixed it. Nice work. Nice work. Let's see if I missed anything while, while my brain was going from A to B to Z. <laughs> <laughs> 21 down, sort. Uh, ignore me. Carry on as you were. One across, abject. Lovely. And that uses our J that we weren't sure about. Well, we were sure, but we couldn't think how it was going to fit for this clue. Abject works perfectly. Nice thinking, Charlie. To waylay, now it starts with A, I'm going to go with ambush. Oops. Sorry for the scroll. That fits there. Tamsin agrees. Excellent. So 11 across. Starts with S. An air-filled cavity in one's head. Mine is not often filled with air. It's normally filled with concrete. It is sinus. Arcade agrees. Lovely. I like it when my brain ticks and then somebody puts what's in my head in the chat. It's like validation. Can't beat a bit of validation. Uh, always be chatting. This is a you kind of clue. E.G. Carl Pujamon. Seven letters. Probably not uh, filling it in or uh, saying it properly, but you can read. Carl Pujamon. I don't know. Carles Puig Demont. I'm glad you said concrete. Not that I wish you congestion. Yeah, I'm congestion city most of the time, especially in the mornings. I'll leave you mull that one. Always be chatting if you're still listening. <laughs> he lost his car. Poor fella. <laughs> Carless. <laughs> it took me a while, but I got there. It took me far too long, but I got there in the end. Rowan, eight three. What is a Rowan? Other than the name of a, an Irishman in a terrible boy band. Mountain Ash. That makes sense. I knew I'd heard it in a kind of fiery context. Thank you, Charlie. Mountain Ash. Was it you that said you weren't you weren't had never done a crossword before earlier? Scrolling back to see. Yeah. Considering you'd not done a crossword before, you're just nailing it now. Absolutely nailing it, smashing it out of the park. Uh, 19 down flare. Yes, like a solar. Flare, for example. Fits with a bowler as well. That's lovely. 23 across could be stilted. Yeah. Because we're not, we're not convinced by stood, are we? Let's clear that. Sighted? Yeah, okay. It'll do for... Do for the moment. Do for the moment. Makes more sense now. I do think stilted is a, a good answer for that. Dead. 2-4. Second word has got an E as the penultimate letter. All of the colloquials I can think for dead are not this short, you know, like belly up or as a dodo. <laughs> oh, nice. I'm gonna put him on ice. That's not enough letters, Dave. Well, we're gonna do it anyway. 
you're Italian American, why is your name Dave? I don't know, Fred. Lack of imagination, perhaps. Very best. 14 down, seven letters. Begins with O. <laughs> Shut up with your bestest. It's the bestest. Bestest. Oh, it doesn't fit. And if we haven't got very best, then 16 down is shrewdness. Do something shrewdly. It's 19 down, not laser. Light amplification. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is laser, which ruins Ebola. Yeah. Okay, so let's change that. Oops. Oops, can't type. Right. Karis. Science. What was the... um? No, that's C. diff. Never mind. I was asking a question, then it came to me. It could just be a virus. Yeah, we're trying to think of specific ones. Where are you typing right now? Let's clear that. Yeah, we're trying to think of specific viruses rather than just saying virus. I'm glad you've eaten and have returned, Mike. <laughs> this is why you need me not to be eating. Yeah, if not, not even to give answers, just to go, no, that doesn't make sense, or you are thinking too hard. Stop thinking too hard. <laughs> 24 across no more yeah if you are dead you are no more yeah yes 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 I feel like that's a silly clue for virus it is a bit a contagious viral disease it's, it's got most of the word in it I don't know I'm, I'm convinced by laser so the ending in S fine we might change... I can't think of any viruses that end in S off the top of my head, so... I'm not married to the word. But we're kind of in this corner now. This is all that's left. So the remaining clues are... Uh, E.G. Carl Pujamon. Seven letters. Something, 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 something. L something N. Mike says Catalan. Okay. Oh, why? Sixteen down. Shrewdness. Six letters. Just clear what we had. Something C, something V, maybe, something N. The optimum. Fit. 22 across mumps. Hmm, it could be mumps. I like the sound of that more than just virus because of just because it's got viral in the clue. It is a good call. Yeah, yeah. Um, 16 down could be acumen, which works now. Good, good, good. Uh, right, so what did you say for this one? Optimum. Oh, it does fit. I can't spell. Optimum. That seems to be complete. Let's do a checky, checky, check, check. It claims we've got them all right. And so, that is another crossword in the books. Very well done. Very, very well done. Whoop whoop, GG's if you've got them. Throw out your GG's. And get your GG's in. Horses in the chat if you don't have any GG's. Or squirrels if you're subscribed, just because you've got to use them, right? Good old Jez Squirrel. I thought mumps at the start, but it didn't fit until the end. That's the the thing about doing this the way that we're doing it now where we don't check the answers as we go we don't get that immediate answer and so things do click a lot later 
Yeah, who's that GG comes from? Right, so I'm going to give you the choice now. Do we want to move straight into crossword number three? Or would we like a words on stream interlude? You can type uh, one for crossword, two for words on stream. Let us know in the chat. <laughs> More crosswords. So Mike says uh, one. Which way around did I say it? I'll type it in so I stop forgetting. One for words on stream. Two for crosswords. There you go. <laughs> GG means Granny Garner to me. There you go. So one or two. One for words on stream. Two for crossword. Three. Let me know what you prefer. If you take too long, I'll choose for you. That's a vote for crosswords. That's two votes for crosswords if you include... Uh, more crosswords. I'm going to be taking Hannah up in a minute. Do you want to bring her in and say goodnight now? While we're in a reprieve? Let's jump into chatting. Hannah's going to come in so you can say goodnight to her. Three, both. Yeah, we, we're going to do both. We've got time to do both. But what first? Hello. Come say hello to people. They all want to see the brave girl. There's the camera. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Tamsin says night night. Mike says night night. Mike says hi. Say hi, Mike. <laughs> What's that face? <laughs> you looking at yourself? Tamsin says you are super brave today. What did you do today? Where did we go? We went to the doctor today. We did, didn't we? And what did you do, brave girl, at the doctor? I made sure my shoulder is good. You made sure your shoulder is good, yeah? That's what the uh, vaccination does. Make sure your shoulder's good. Where did you have the jab? Where was the jab? <laughs> in the doctor's room. I meant on your body. Where on your body were the? Did you have the jabs? Was it in your eye? Mm, no. No. It was on my shoulders. Or was in your shoulders? That's right. Everyone wants to see your t-shirt. I'll see it quite. We hold you up a little bit. Ugh! Who's on your t-shirt? Dougie. Dougie. You like Dougie? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone here likes Dougie too. <gasps> What's that? <laughs> you can't hear it, can you? Here you go. Can you hear it now? <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to sing it to you. <laughs> right. So now it's time for you to go to bed, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, mummy's going to take you up and do all the things. So, no night. No night. I'll see you in the morning. I'll see you in the morning. Give me a big kiss. Did you, did you just burp on my laptop? That <laughs> 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 then in my face, I suppose. Give me a kiss. Love you. I will see you when your shoulders get better. Good night. Good night. Shut the door. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> right. Uh, thank you for uh, humouring me while I say good night to my daughter. Uh, I think the winner is another crossword, so I'll just get that ready and we'll crack in straight away to crossword number three. Uh, I think she was trying to come back in then. Crossword number 
Crossword number three. Here we go. Here are the clues. The across is first of all South African city, 12. Eminent, 5. Wool fat, 7. Gasp for breath, like a hot dog. Or, not a hot dog, a hot dog. A dog that is hot, not a bun with meat in it. Uh, four bear, eight. Movie role for several dog stars, six. Teaching establishment, six. At a hedge, anagram, make progress. Three, five. Flock of larks, quails or swans, four. Uh, moment for a light afternoon meal, seven. Moment for, oh, I just read that. Show with Bronco Busters, five. Uh, results, parlor game, 12. And the downs, excursions, seven. Verdi Opera, four. Stockings, six. Term of imprisonment, eight. Dark, five. Angels Yonder, anagram. The governing body, of the Church of England, seven, five. Not expressing regret, 12. Building with many stories, four hyphen four. Expected before now, seven. Something French for 22, six. Two, five. And cereal fiber, four. <laughs> Let's uh, throw that up. Hannah is so adorable. Sign me up for babysitting. Yes. <laughs> okay. One across. Johannesburg. Good luck spelling. Yeah, well, I'm just going to copy yours. Because, yeah, otherwise I wouldn't. Yo. Oh, put a P in it. That's how you spell Johannesburg. Johannesburg. H A N N E S. Berg. Thank you very much, Mike. 10 across lanolin not okay 10 10 10 10 wool fat lanolin okay lovely answer thank you very much seven down general synod i have no idea what's going on with that question but it fits might have to explain that one for me, Mike. That's gone straight over my head. <clears throat> 23 across. Oh, yes, with Bronco Busters, a rodeo. Thanks, Tamsin. Three down. Ada, Ida. Thank you. Four down. Stockings. Jez's Saturday night. You wish, mate. You wish I rocked up to a casual Saturday night stream in stockings. You'd love it. You'd absolutely love it. <laughs> Lol, the burp was hilarious. Yeah, I don't know how much of it you heard, but it was like my mic is here and she just burped there. Like, right there. I don't know why she leant down. To, like... I asked for a kiss and she just went... Burp. And burped on my laptop. Right into the, the cooling pad crazy child uh, 8 down remorseless type Jess type remorse what am I spelling wrong remorse less doesn't seem to fit am I doing something wrong am I being a tit R-E-M-O-R-S-E -E less. No, I don't think I'm being a tit. I think it doesn't fit. Uh, 18 across. Get ahead. Yeah, so I'll clear that. Because that doesn't work. And then get ahead. And then okay, thank you. And dun, 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 12 across. Ancestor. Thank you, that one's right. Unremorseful. Got a G in it now. It's 
It's got a G in it now, so maybe not. Uh, General Sano got killed by Vader in A New Hope, I think. Yeah, that's that sounds more what I would uh, <laughs> what I would know about it. Four down is actually nylons. Okay. Thank you. General Synod is the governing arm of the C of E, but I prefer Alex's answer. I do too. Why is it... Why is it... I assume General is not a rank then. It's like a... Uh, well, I'm trying to define General. Like... Can't do it. Brain isn't working. Uh, sorry I went and got the mail if I was gone. That's fine. Come on in here and nail some answers for us. 15 across. School. Correct. Uh, 16 down, overdue. It is overdue. It was expected before now. 11 across. Pant. Yes. Like a, like a dog. A hot dog. Not a hot dog. Went on a tangent there. Thank you, Arcade. 2 down. Outings. Those things we used to do. But we don't do any more. Excursions to the fridge. That's about where we are at this point. Hot dogs in pants. I can't type either, it seems. <laughs> it's just what they call it. Yeah, I, I, I'm going to look it up later and find out, but weird. 19 down. Twain. Okay. That clue could have been uh, what Jonathan Ross calls a train. Twain. Five down. Sentence. Yes, 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 yes. I thought that one when I was reading it. What was the... Oops. What was the other one that I thought as I was reading? Uh, building with many stories is a high rise. Ah, and time's in again. Just as I'm doing it, in it comes. Six down, unlit. Sounds good. Never the twain shall meet. Yeah, it does make sense. It's just a bit of a strange clue. I know I'm getting all these, but I did kind of miss one whole crossword. Mm, not sure that really flies, but I'll let you off. 21 down. Bran. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now I'm with it. Cereal fiber. The fiber in cereal. Bran. It balances out, okay? It does not. It just doesn't. 17 down. A gatto. What's the 22 reference part of that? Something French for 22. What's the 22 bit mean? Shared between 22 people? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something French for the moment for a light afternoon meal. Okay. Which is, uh, yeah, tea time. Hey, I want to be invited to the kinds of tea times where you just dispense with the other food and have a gatto. That is my kind of tea time. Okay. Let's see some that we have letters for. So 20 across, a flock of larks, quails, or swans. Four letters, something E, something Y. What is tea time? Um, also known as dinner, the evening meal. There is also high tea here in the UK, what that 0.3 people do, but stereotypically we all do which is the, the little cakes and sandwiches on the, the multi-layer tray. And you drink tea with your finger in the air. And you're waited on by people with 
things draped over their arms. And they bring in the, the tray. And you have your tea and eat your scone. But yeah, no one does that. The first time that I saw anybody have high tea, it was in Chicago. It wasn't in this country. I've never seen anyone, anyone in this country, do that. Finger, finger in the air when you're drinking apparently means you have syphilis traditionally. Well, it depends what you're drinking, doesn't it? If it's a pint, if you're drinking a pint and your finger's in the air, then yeah, you've probably got something wrong with you. And syphilis seems consistent, but... Anyway... Back to the question. Do we know what this flock of larks, quails, or swans is? Bird. I would have thought fit, but it doesn't with the letters. Drinking tea. It means you don't know. Stop spoiling my joke. I don't want the actual answer. A bevy? A bevy of swans, I've heard. I haven't heard it for the other two, but... Again, I'm not massively familiar with larks or quails bevy will fit for now uh, 24 across consequences ah that is a parlor game oh. used to love consequences in school move your role for de several dog stars lassie couple of dog questions in this Uh, so not expressing regret. I'm going to say, given the ends in C, is unapologetic. Have I spelt that right? Is that an O there? It is apologetic, like apology. Yeah, it must be. Nine across. Eminent. Noted. <laughs> that has been noted, yeah. And that's the last one. Wonderful, let's check it. Nothing disappears. We are victorious. GG's, GG's. Crossword number three is in the books. Last week, this was where the wheels came off a little bit. The fourth crossword we did last week was insane. Was stupid. Stupid difficult. Stupid hard. So let's hope that that isn't the case this time. We've got some time. Let's break it up with a little words on stream. And then we'll finish off with one last crossword take us up to the top of the hour and we'll jump on over to somebody for a raid are we ready for some words on stream are we all prepared uh, I'm going to disappear in the early stages to blow my nose but uh, you've got this covered especially in the early rounds you guys rock here we go words on stream enjoy
Here we are, coming back, coming back. Hello. I can breathe again. Lol, peen. I was going to try Nike, as in the god of the Greeks, is it? Rather than the brand, but alas, it did not want it. Another level smashed. Covered in tissue paper. Lovely. Four of us in. If you're lurking and you haven't played this game before, literally just put the answers to the anagrams that are at the top in the chat and it will throw it in. If you put a word in, it will lock you for a small period. Keep an eye on the, the ticker with the locks and it will then drop your lock and you can answer again. So you go in as soon as possible with your best answer because it will lock you for a small period. Level three. Here we go. Is this really going to be one? No. <laughs> Command. That's how I felt about Condom not being there. Damn. Moans in. Where I was going next. Oh, it's only one O. Nomad. Good word. I was putting coda. <laughs> Three codas all at pretty much the same time. Good job, Lamia and Nana. Something between coda and dam alphabetically. We've only got four letter words left now. Something between coda and dam, and something between dam and moan. There's coma. Something between dam and moan now. It's not coming. But it doesn't matter. This level has been well and truly smashed to smithereens. Dona! Kev Waggy coming in with the game saving, well, game completing answer. Welcome. We've jumped three levels. We're going up to level six. Which is pretty good going. Let's crack straight through. Okay. This is a hard one. Already. Unless you and Jay Harmstone who just comes in there with Poof. Yeah, it's okay. With stickies there, then uh, sticks there too. And tick, yep. You literally have a stick party. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I'm like looking for stick or sticky in every puzzle or word game that we do. Something after four letters after there it is tick. So I was gonna say something after tick. What could that have been? Okay, early alphabet stuff now. Two words that fit between city and kits. Icky. Um. 
try it, see if it works. Cyst! Good word. <clears throat> good work, folks. Good work. Jumping another three. I was just content with sitting this round out, but couldn't resist doing sticky. <clears throat> yep. There it is. Here we go, then. Level nine. We have a fake letter this time. Keep your eyes out. If you know the fake letter, report it in chat. I will read it out for people. Dresser. And redress. Usually is a sign of a good night if you have to redress. The tea is fake? The tea... No, it can't be. Yes, tea is fake. I agree. Lamia, you're right. Tea is fake. <laughs> We're through to the next level, so don't worry too much, but the more points we get here, the more we skip. It gets us right through to the difficult ones. Oh, there's Deer from Little Cute Girl, that's where I was going to next. Deet. Nine, nine, nine. Sarah. In at the last moment from Charlie. Good job. Let's have a little look at the rankings before we move on to level 12. Another three skipped. Seems to be the order of business for this game. Uh, Lamia Umbra with 116 in first. Charlie Pika, 96 in second. Welsh Nana K, 45. Uh... MJ Harmstone slumming it in 4th with 43. I'm with 37 in 5th. Tamsin with 34 in 6th. And Lil Cute Girl uh, with uh, Dia got her her 5. Let's go level 12. Boop, boop. Be right back, Lurk. Okay. You'll slide down the rankings. <laughs> okay, there's a fake letter once again. There are U's for the Q, so maybe it isn't the Q this time. It's usually the Q. So let's throw that in and see if it works. Hmm, maybe it is a Q or a U. No, two U's have been used in Nurture, so it is Q. Q is fake. Because we tried Queen and Queer and neither worked, so Q is fake. Turnt. <laughs> I do love that colloquial. It's all turnt around. Ha! We smashed true and untrue at the same time then. That was amazing. And then truer comes along. Love that. Rerun the fun. Uh, 
I was going to put in tune. Good. Okay, our last one is alphabetically between runt and true. And it's gone. It is gone. But we smashed it anyway. We are on to level 15. Another three skipped. MJ Harmstein up into third now, 78. The top two stay the same. Turn is actually what it was, T-E-R-N, okay. Slumming it in third now, Jeremy. <laughs> I knew that would rile you up. So, right, fine, I'll show this. I'm gonna do words and stuff. I will smash your chill. Level 15, here we go. Fake letter, hidden letter. You be careful with some of the letters that are there. That's all I'm going to say about that. I think either the I or the O are fake. Maybe it's the I. I think it's the I. Or the C, you think, maybe? We might be boned here, folks. Can't find the the hidden letter. The fake is either the C or the I, I would suggest. Well, that's all it could be. Still don't have a poon. <laughs> My God, that was difficult. What was that? What was that? <sighs> Woof. No records broken this time, guys. <laughs> Nonsense. I know. I know. You've got no argument from me. That was ridiculous. Yeah, F, indeed. Forget your GG's this time. F. <laughs> yeah, GG to everyone for tolerating that. That was stupid. Hopefully it's not an omen for... Uh, our final crossword, crossword, crossword of the day. Romanarian, welcome back. Haven't seen you in a long time. Welcome. Uh, Jinx you. I turn up and you fail. It's probably my fault. Let's be honest. It usually is. You, you've joined us for the last crossword, Lewis. Join on in. Here are the clues. Uh, you can start putting answers in the chat. MJ Harmstone, you chill. You chill, man. Issuer of parking tickets, seven, six. Oil drilling platform, three. Indifference, nine. Comic, eight. Slay, four. French Riviera Resort, six. Alcoholic drink flavoured with aniseed, six. Monetary unit of Iran, Four. Against the current, eight. Mock, ersatz, nine. Possess, three. Prime Minister from 1945 to 1951, seven, six. The downs, flashlight, five. 
Uh, Disputatious, 13. Agitated, 8. Spiny Desert Plant, 6. Former Indian Coin, or a girl's name, 4. Fixed in one's opinions or attitudes, 4 hyphen 2 hyphen 3 hyphen 4. Flummox, 7. Strict Disciplinarian, 8. Pertaining to the Heart, 7. Dash, 6. Scottish Minister's Residence, 5. US Composer, Bard Enclosure, 4. Okay. Let's scroll up and catch up. Uh, 1A, Parking Warden. I think so. Parking Warden. Thank you, Karis. Uh, I will not chill. This is not crosswords and chill. Ten across. Humorous. Lovely answer. Thank you, Charlie. Um, I could be mean and leave others to get the Prime Minister question, given it's my specialist subject. But 22 is Clement Attlee. I actually knew that because of... Uh... What the... What the... What... Why is it not spelling? Clement... Ah, double T. Okay. Attlee. I knew that because of the crown. So I was good. Uh, been very busy working life. Yeah, I feel you, man. I feel you. Uh, the last time that you were here was for the the Robot War stream, and I haven't gone back to that game yet. I need to do that at some point. Uh, cactus for the spiny desert plant, I assume. Nana K. Um, but it starts with G, so I'm gonna say not. Uh, Thirteen down is probably cardial. Thirteen down. Thirteen down. Yes. Oh. Cardiac, I would say. It's got a C now. At the beginning. 21 across. To possess. Own. Yeah. 5 down. Rose. Starts with A. Unfortunately. Uh, first half of 1A would be traffic. Traffic patrol. It's traffic warden. Uh, it's parking wa warden or traffic traffic. It might be you no. Know, it's parking warden. Yeah, it's a British thing. Um, Nineteen down. Buck. No, ends in E. From Clement at Lee. One across must be traffic warden because one is torch. Okay. That's fine. But Warden is a, a British thing. Uh, one down is Torch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Flashlight, Torch. Cool. Robot Wars. Yeah, I was playing... What was it? Arenas of Destruction. One of my first streams I did when I joined Twitch was Arenas of Destruction. Uh, and I, It was a while ago. I think it was July or August last year. I haven't gone back to it. Um, but I... I had robot battles on an eight across a rig, and that was good fun. I think I will go back to that some point soon. Uh, uh, so four down is now cactus with traffic. Yeah, there you go. Thank you, Nana. <clears throat> I will get cactus in. I've already loved Arenas of Destruction, was obsessed with Robot Wars as a kid. Me too, as was Real Manarin. We discussed a lot of Robot Wars in school. Real Manarin is one of my IRL friends from back in the day. I would sit and watch Robot Wars. I'd record it on videotape. I would pause it on the, uh, the profiles and I would make my own handwritten profiles of all the robots and keep them in a folder. Did that for the first like three or four series. Loved Robot Wars. 13 across can. Beautiful, beautiful. 
I lost interest in Robot Wars when it became just about the fighting, really. I really liked the, the obstacle courses and all that kind of stuff. We've been watching BattleBots on YouTube. The old Terahertz team are on it as beta. Oh, okay. I've, I did get that BattleBots series that they did. And I've got it somewhere on a hard drive. I need to watch it at some point. Uh, I led a Robot Wars club in primary school. Nice, nice. Never got that far. I was very much in secondary school when Robot Wars was on. Argumentative. I'm assuming that's for two. Disputatious. Argumentative. That fits wonderfully. Thank you, Nana. <clears throat> Three down. Flurried. Seen series one and two for the first time in years a couple of months ago. Forgot series two, Panic Attack. Yeah, obviously fairly local for us. Growing up in Wales. Up the road in Cumbran. I remember <clears throat> for the the final of series two of Robot Wars, I was away at a camp with air cadets and then I was gutted because some rando person at a service station spoiled who had won Robot Wars and was like I was going home to watch that I, I videotaped it and you spoiled it like 14, 13, 14 year old me was livid uh, 16 across Ryle or Rial however you want to pronounce that thanks Mike uh, 9 across Uncertain that sounds right Certain. Thank you, Lamia. Eleven across. Kill or do in. Eleven across. Or do in. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to say it's kill because uh, otherwise it would have a hyphen in the middle. The reboot with Dara O'Brien wasn't as fun. Some of the decisions were odd. I I haven't watched it. I've seen bits of it in passing, but it's. Again, just robot fighting. I'm not interested. I'd much rather there be early rounds where you have to have races or obstacle courses to make the robots a bit more well-rounded rather than just 25 flippers. It's not as fun. Uh, I'm trying to be chill, but I'm getting the hard ones. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Disappointed at the reboot is so slow. Yeah, I might watch it one day, but I've got plenty of other content to be watching before that happens. Anyway, this is not a Robot Wars stream. This is Crosswords and Chill. Let's see what we can get going. Um, an alcoholic drink flavoured with aniseed. I feel like I know that. What's the aniseedy flavoured one? If Karis wasn't putting my child to bed, she'd know that one. Alcoholic drink flavor with aniseed. No, it's not coming. Seven down, non plus. Yes. It's an interesting word, isn't it? Non plus. Fixed in one's opinions or attitudes. That's going to be in, I'd suggest. Three is probably going to be the. We'll leave it out for now, though. Fifteen down, sprint. Yeah, I think so, Lewis. Thanks. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. Gives us a P as the second letter of against the current. Eight letters. I think we probably need a few more letters to get to that. Uh, 18 down. The Scottish Minister's Residence. I don't know where they live. But it's something something N something E. I know that Stormont is the um, the kind of parliament building, right? Where do they live? Good eve, Reese. How's it going? Um, 
Pokemon. Reese, you probably know this. Alcoholic drink flavoured with aniseed. Not bad if I miss the folks. Yes, they popped in earlier. They left about uh, 7 o'clock, I think. We're just wrapping up our last crossword and then we're going to jump over to somebody else with a bit of a raid. Pernod. Is there another one? Because we've got S on the end here. Six letters ending in S. It's in my brain somewhere, it's just not coming. That one's not coming either. Former Indian coin, a girl's name. Six down, died in the wool. And then Pernod fits. Wait, what? Six down could be baffled and then Pernod fits. Six down. Wait, what? Seven down, sorry, okay. Baffled. Then Pernod fits, okay. And then. Died in the wool. I can't get it to fit at the top here. No, that's not going to be it. What the f Clear. Go away. Can't get that to fit. Charlie, I can't get that to fit. Really like the answer. Feels like it should fit, but I can't get it to fit with what we've got. Uncertain is going to be wrong then, is it? I'm not sure about that. Uncertain seems to fit perfectly. We might be doing some checks soon. We can't. 17 upstream? Yeah, that'll be it. Upstream. Uh, Feral Magical Girl. 20 across imitation? Yeah. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Thank you. 12 down, a strict disciplinarian. Eight letters. Something E, something T, something N, something T. One A has to be warden at the end. Yeah, yeah, it does, doesn't it? So that's not right. That's not right. And then, it, yeah, this has to be non plus, like we said. So it can't be pernod. It can't be pernod. It just doesn't make anything else work. It's uncertain, just fits too well. Non plus fits too well. Kill fits too well. So, yeah. This aniseed one has to be something else. Pastis? Give that a go. That makes that the for sure. Anais? Yeah, yeah, it could be Anais. That's the one I was thinking of. Don't spell that. Double I? No. And, uh... Double S? Like that? I'm going to check that one, because I want to know that one. No. So let's go with <laughs> Pastis and check it. It's Pastis. Okay, there we go. Anais is what I was, uh thinking but it is a bit on the nose considering they've put aniseed so that makes sense okay so that one is right we've checked that one and that one only so going with what what was said earlier died in the wool maybe that's dead in the wool dead in the wool oh and that killed i checked it and it it is died in the wool so uncertain is not correct. Uncertain isn't correct. I was going to say pasties because it made it in the si in made it in six D. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so that works. It's nine across that is wrong in all of that. An indifference, unconcerned. Is that fit? Um, on, oops. On 
unconcern. It is unconcern. Nice. I'm doing some checking now because it's too. I'm not convinced by non plus. I am now. I am now. This has been checked to be correct. I'm pretty sure all the others fit, so I think non plus is right. It fits now. 12 down. Martinet. Uh, yeah. Okay. Is that the last one? No. So we've got Scottish Minister's Residence, five letters. And we've got a US composer or a bard enclosure. Four letters. Something A, something E. A cage. And then Mance. We'll try that. Thank you, Farrell. And now, oh, there's one up here. Didn't see that one. Former Indian coin. Girl's name. Anna. Try right, Anna. Yeah. Okay. Let's check everything. That's got all of our answers in. That's going to be an E then, is it? Oh, there you go. Check all. And now we are good. Lovely. Thank you for the O, Lamia. Thank you. Okay, that's our fourth, cross fourth crossword complete. Oh no, that was not right. Wasn't, unless it's an S. Yeah, there you go. It's an S. Yeah. I've never heard of that. <laughs> but Mance was right. It was just we used the wrong sibilant sound. Lovely. That's that done. Four crosswords in the bag. Two games of words on stream. Largely successful stream. Very thankful to you all for coming. It's been lovely. I was concerned that it would be a bit quiet because of the displaced time. But it was all good. It was all good. Um, I am now going to drop you in uh, my primetime streamer network colleague, Mama S. She's playing Mass Effect Andromeda. Um, if you wouldn't mind hanging around for the raid, dropping your emotes, let her know where you came from. And I will see you tomorrow night for Don't Get Me Cocktailed. I'm probably going to be a bit drunk, just to be honest. Probably a little bit drunk. Nova coming in at the end. Thanks for coming, Nova. Live long and prosper. Let's go see Mama S. Wonderful, wonderful streamer. Don't get me shirt-faced. I probably will be shirt-faced. Yeah. My shirt will be clearly over my face. Thank you for coming. I will see you soon. Don't forget to join us in the Discord if you haven't already. There's the link. Give you a few seconds to click that and get yourself in our Discord. It's not just me, many other people as well. There's a lot of good conversation in there. A lot of fantastic streamers. And I will see you soon. Good night, everybody. Have a good one. Bye-bye.